Hey everyone, how are things? Uh, hope all is good today. Um, just arrived home, having a cup of uh, hot lemon drink. Um, I feel like my immune system is down a little bit the last while, so I thought I'd uh, hit up on some vitamin C. So, um, just share a little story today actually about a brand that we were speaking to. They're from the Czech Republic and um, they're looking to expand into the States. And we were talking about that idea. Um, now, normally what we do, we, we like running ads, okay, to acquire customers and we use email to build out, you know, retention and, and profit over time, okay? So we were kind of talking over and back, back me and one of my uh, colleagues there today about what we could do here on a kind of a cost-effective level or at least as a test because the brand wasn't really willing to sort of spend a whole lot of money on purchase conversion ads, okay? They're a little bit wary. They have a great product, okay? And it's doing well in their region, but you know, the States is a different sort of region entirely, okay? And when you're entering a new kind of location, you know, people aren't aware of you. So how do you sort of combat that? Um, one of the ideas that we spoke about, me and uh, Jacopo, was uh, that we would uh, create maybe brand awareness campaigns as opposed to just purchase conversion, create uh, awareness campaigns. But do a sort of like a lead gen um, type of campaign where we build out a landing page with a really good offer for the product and target, say, wherever around the States. And the idea would be to actually just create an email list, okay, where we would actually create a really good offer, create a back end funnel, and nurture these leads over time. Almost like a kind of a launch, really, at the end of the day. It, it, Kind of is really, you know, where you're, where you're, where you're basically kind of creating this sort of frame where you're building out, um, you know, hype and sort of a sequence in place that actually just acquire acquires people's attention and nurtures them, builds a bit of a relationship, shows the value propositions through email, even through ads as well uh, via brand awareness. But um, this is something that you could use as well if you're ever looking to a, even launch, like even brand, even brand new brands uh, who have a product and they're looking to sort of get their get their uh, get their story out there and get their their product to uh, the market. So instead of actually just creating a more kind of a complicated purchase conversion kind of like entire funnel, use something simple like you know getting a really good landing page, collecting email addresses, and then nurturing those people. Um, into the funnel and eventually sort of making offers as well um, is a really good way of actually being very cost effective in entering a new market or starting out from scratch. Um, you you get to get you get to you know you can turn on these ads you can create the awareness you funnel people in and it does take a little bit more time but it is a more cost effective kind of solution. So moral of the story. You don't always have to go for purchase conversion ads, okay? Now, we would, of course, when we're scanning out a brand, because that's the most effective way, okay, is to go through the con purchase conversion ads on, on the likes of, say, Instagram, Facebook, uh, Google, for example, and building out lifetime value through uh, email. But um, that is a more complicated process. If you're a little sort of risk averse, then, you know, why not try? You know, not, why not try? I, I'll always recommend building an email list, whether it's a customer database or even just lead, you know, where you can kind of nurture the lead, okay? But I think that's a good approach. So, yeah, that's kind of like the tip or the little sort of insider story that I wanted to share today is that, you know, I know some of you guys that are following me, um, some of you have successful brands that we spoke about before in the past and you're looking to sort of do amazing things with. And then some of you are, you know, a few steps behind and are looking to, you know, get their great product out there, by the way, but just don't know how to do that effectively. So that's one of the ways of doing it. Um, build an email list, generate leads, nurture them over time, create a really good sequence, create a really good offer and generate some sales, get people, um, get your product into the hands of people your target market and just get them get get feedback you know you you want you want to you want to deliver a good experience and you want to get feedback and testimonials and social proof so you can put on your websites so you can run 
with ads you can put, put into email all that kind of good stuff because social proof as i think i've said in a previous video it might have been yesterday's one is that no, nothing nobody sells your product better than you know your customers and that is so true so that's all i have today guys enjoy i'll catch you guys tomorrow take care